and uh, i bring in all the wishes on behalf of all the faculty members of speed to thank, dr thank you so much avnit singh you. for scoring a very good rank and top class rank of 381 in mca surgical group uh, for a super specialty exam and neat ss 2023 session congratulations and best wishes to you three patient three three things help me sir first my faith on my the supreme power second the speed you are 28th edition belly notes and third my patience and preservance and my family great and, no that's my only advice to everyone to be patient <laughs> age does not matter correct correct doctor can we can i know your brief background where you started your mbbs your ms and your practice me come to i'm old guy i started no, no, no. my mbbs in 1998 and finished in 2000 uh three and then from government medical college amritsar so then i did my post graduation ms surgery from government medical college patiala so then i went to a charitable hospital at bias that's a radha swami hospital and uh, i worked there under the uh, one of the great surgeons dr bilwan singh tong for six years now i was practicing my father is a surgeon so i was practicing at my home place I was doing general surgery but somehow this click and it worked up <laughs> doctor what is your uh, choice great to know your background journey in medicine career can we know uh, what is the interest in mch that you wanted to do so right now i am more interested in urology urology okay yes. so can you tell us the idea of doing urology I mean when it started I mean it was for a long time or it came up uh, recently can you tell us on that uh, no sir i had dreams but i was not able to make it up because once you uh, put in a gap of uh, some years and you start doing general surgery and you stuck to that i got an mch rank of 47th in 2015 gujarat but i left i could not get urology could not get onco so i only got plastic and neuro so i left it so then the gap comes that's a big hindrance i would advise anybody all the newcomers to either stick to the not to put in a gap it's must if you want to prepare prepare it then even okay doctor once you decided to go on when did you start your preparation how do you, what all you did and how do you achieved this today sir uh, i started in uh, december and uh, i was going to the hospital also meanwhile and uh, with uh, that i studied belly and subastin general part and i st- uh, stuck to the speed i did all uh, subastin based notes and uh, the belly's 28th edition the you don't have to open the book if you do speed 28th edition notes there is no need in the end you cannot open the uh, book only you can read the speed 28th notes and you will definitely get a rank it's you can have it written on a white paper for me do will definitely get a rank you don't have to choose any other app even i think what is great it is great you are one of the greatest so it's it's great <laughs> yeah. i joined few apps but i read speed more more and we were six the main uh, policy we were six group of people from different parts we became study partners and we are good friends right now so the main uh, was discussion so we discussed like 150 200 questions daily and uh, that discussion helps a lot and that uh, because you memorize a lot after discussing and that helps that was very true because there was a change in edition actually from 27th to 28th and it was Now, very predicted that more questions could come from because I prepared recall two also. I mean, I got ready yesterday. I saw almost eighty percent of questions were from Bailey on the iteration, line to line and word to word. And I have made all these one fifty questions now slowly. Now I know from what percentage has come from Bailey, what percent of subsistence and rest of the places. Now that uh, that become a vital part and. Uh, and also we will not know where it comes from so we need to uh, thoroughly go through line by line and one has yes, to go through line by line i mean it is not i mean it is not like a movie i mean it has to be like a conceptual so then uh, it took a lot of time to prepare only for that book i also felt very difficult there is a very tough book actually the new edition uh, the new edition is very tough sir. very tough yes uh, and lot of changes lot, lot of gid is totally changed gid is totally changed and uh, the exam was like you cannot predict from where where did it come then you 
come to home then you see that <laughs> like um, half of it is from delhi like right. that yeah. very true so uh, it was not like he, you could cram it and go it and do it it was not like that Correct. you have to study it thoroughly but yes, i yes. think i just say ki speed is the best that's my <laughs> I, i don't have words and um, one of my partner has told me to stop all things and just speed speed and i'm thankful to my all six persons to who studied with me five persons they also got very good ranks sir okay okay they all got I mean all uh, surgery surgical, surgical group sir surgical group okay yeah. so all got uh, good ranks very good good ranks very good very good and convey my regards to all of them <laughs> so it, it will be really great because when I mean, studying in a group and as a group it wins and it is better to do a party actually it's very we I mean, it will be convenient that everybody can be part of it and everybody will start uh, enjoying it so there is so, no oh, you memorize much more i think so. so but you have to read speed if you want to get selected <laughs> that's for sure jitni marzi aap sare hain speed speed hi rahega i have wonderful i have very high respect thank you thank you doctor great words and it means a lot to us and uh, doctor can we know uh, what is a message that you want to give to uh, the future aspirants who want to do mch and from your experience and what is the message that you want to convey so that people can follow it so first of all doing the ms i, I think one should study belly cover to cover and uh, not to put in a gap like i put uh, i suffered now at this age it's difficult but still i god has been kind and uh, the last thing is to do at least 150 mcqs per day with theory at least give 100 to 150 mcqs per day so that yeah. uh, you get a grasp of the mcqs and because mcq and theory are entirely different doctor i want to just put a point here about the gap you said probably uh, 12 13 years of gap so yes i completed my ms in 2008 sir 15 years of gap hmm. 15 years of gap i did my mcs after 13 years of gap after general surgery yeah and i will tell you there is one beauty in that today there is one point for doing an mch and getting out of the exam quickly and to get into mch that's a point back to back uh, mbbs ms or dnb then go on to mch there's one straight way mm-hmm. go straight land in the moon and then start your surgery finished there is nothing else i want that yes. specialty and targeted and bullseye i go and do it yes but what happened what happens is in this journey yes yes there is something called charm of general surgery there is something there is a beauty of general surgery is there that yes. people without uh, experiencing it they suddenly land up uh, you know super it's a beautiful branch it's a beautiful branch so uh, i am one of the person like you that we thoroughly enjoyed that phase of life that means from hydrocele to hemorrhoid to thyroid to breast to lap coli to appendix anything down in the body i mean whatever could be operated I mean all done and the patients I mean uh, they're gone I mean there are few yes. percent of complications in spite of it everybody has gone well so that kind of a one completion of a phase of your career uh, I mean is there that's a point to be looked up and yes. i mean i will not consider the point that the gap is in the disadvantage because there people have not been sitting ideal in yes. home or doing nothing okay yes sir uh, so there is a there is a innings already played i mean it's a beautiful first half yes <laughs> first yes. half is played well and the kind of maturity in surgery skills and approaching the patients attenders tackling the complication tackling uh, troubleshooting times and all those Uh, now has been gathered and the kind of uh, understanding of an mc superficiality it will be at a much higher depth and it is yeah. not uh, uh, that will be very uh, the exposure is are very wide wide so mm-hmm. and uh, to me what i have seen in medicine and surgery is it is not the process in medicine that is important it is the end of it is very important and uh, mean mean at the end of the day 
what i wanted to do what i wanted to become I mean, yes. I mean in your 45th and 46th of your age and when you practice urology i mean your patient will not come and ask you sir when did you complete your ms when did yeah. you complete your mch <laughs> urology <laughs> they will not ask all that they will ask sir i have come to you will i become all right you see that's i mean that's the point of discussion there is no point of discussion when we did all this see the point of discussion comes only for us and within yes, us sir. nothing else so and i strongly appreciate I mean I mean Thank people you. who want to accomplish the dream irrespective of time period and place and uh, they have accomplished on one example is today i'm talking to you and uh, and uh, I mean that is is more important and i am i'm i'm a strong person that i always uh, I mean uh, i mean support uh, be with them and promote and try to uh, see them i mean they want to accomplish things for because even i had the dream though i was doing general surgery in back of the mino we have not done mca so far yeah, you yeah. know when will i do <laughs> mca the time is running I mean, so it's all this kind actually it's uh, all designed what i think so it's not in our hand if it is going to happen it's going uh, to happen and it's, the supreme power showed me the direction and studied and went through yeah so it was uh, it was that way that i, I strongly believe in I mean, I, i mean i can understand what i've been running in your mind but still there's an answer to that so my story is similar to you <laughs> <laughs> if i tell you one more story also you will also feel uh, very very uh, i mean just take two minutes more now uh see uh, i was i was doing a I mean mch i was there in the admission in mmc madras medical college okay. uh, and uh, where i did my cardiothoracic surgery and where when i was going for the admission a person before me i mean went for neurosurgery and uh, I, i thought i thought he is a professor has come for some admission for his son and his age is 58 years his age is 58 years oh. and uh, then i came to know he was a candidate I means going for admission then oh. after his admission i spoke to him sir what is it sir i mean i mean uh, i mean i cannot ask him why are you doing it and, yes. and 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 i asked him sir uh, can i know i mean uh, what is there uh, in your mind he said in my mind i want to become a neurosurgeon that is in my mind for various reasons i cannot do so uh, for these years now i feel that i have uh, time to do it and i want to do a neurosurgery Mm. then he got admitted and he went to the seat and he I mean professor head of the department is age only 55 his age is more than the head of the department <laughs> <laughs> so whenever in a polydrama and casualty in a polydrama and a casualty there will be a call and it will be called the thoracic injury a head injury a woman yes. whatever uh, I mean ortho all there will be a memo you know that how the government hospitals operate there will be a yes, memo sir. and to the call over see if, before we all could come see if, if i was in i mean multiple duties along with him parallelly mm-hmm. before all of us could come in he will he, be, he, he will be the person he'll be running and we could see he'll be running and i have never seen he has come late than me whenever the parallel duty he will be the first person to attend the patient and to put the orders and to tell and not only that he will he himself will take a uh, wheel the patient or I mean uh, take the stretcher to the ct scan room and he will mm-hmm. do by himself and yes. uh, he was very enthusiastic he finished this in 61 of his age until today uh, he is a very very busy practitioner of neurosurgery and uh, and he is very very busy i mean it is nothing like that i, I am it's all about the attitude, attitude. about the thinking and uh, what do you think in your mind what that if you can think then you can achieve it people refer cases to him it's not for uh, i mean because someone is in 50s and 60s or 45 50 they don't refer case he, he is now almost 66 67 years now more than that mm-hmm. i mean he is almost 69 years now people refer to him for a simple reason that he is very dedicated and he will deliver the stuff because even all three years in mmc he has delivered he has been the first person to utter any person so people have enormous amount of confidence in him if we send a refer a patient to him that the patient will come out safely and he will take care of mm-hmm. the patient nicely so that confidence he has built up because of his way of working so i just want to share uh, about the so much, sir. <laughs> it made my day sir <laughs> i now remember it for lifetime ah, now you see the gap now my goodness and uh, my teachers who taught me cardiothoracic surgery i'll tell you the first teacher is 82 years and the second oh. teacher is 79 years I mean how you go for a case you operate still that energy is there in operate they are surgeons they are operating surgeons 
I, I can. <laughs> Sir, 82 years, 79 years. And the 82 years is the first surgeon, 79 to is the second surgeon, assistant to him. Uh, much Still the same enthusiasm they are operating. And uh, so my boss, uh, under which uh, I did my general surgery, post general surgery training uh, at Bias, he was 84 and I joined him. He had two bypasses, one mm. angioplasty, one uh, pilothotomy, and uh, he like, um, uh, operated till 90. Then he got stroke and bad luck. But uh, I trained under him five years. And he had no tremors, and he was no doing tremors. all. Correct. He was doing mitral valvotomies, and he was doing <laughs> everything. So, um, like, I could not imagine like, as a general surgeon because earlier general surgeons used to be trained in all the. They used to train in one specialty, like go to UK from Correct. he retired as principal of some medical college, so that's why he was trained in that. Uh, great doctor wonderful talking to you uh, today Thank you so much. a lot of uh, much appreciate. <laughs> a lot of uh, things that we have discussed and i once Thank again uh, bring in all the wishes uh, to you Thank you so much on behalf of all the faculty members and speed medical institute for a great Thank you, sir. i'm uh, on, i'm indebted to speed sir i'm indebted to you. Thank you doctor thank you very much Thank you. Sir. <laughs> welcome Thanks, all sir. the best yeah.